And hello everyone and welcome to another Lumia Legacy Challenge. Today we are gonna be spinning the type wheel and building a team around the specific type. And I am joined hello. by Amingo. Say hello. Hello. I am back. Maybe I can win this time or just give you another win to your streak. Let's see. But this time we will know each other's typing, so there is uh, some counter strategies we can do. Yeah, I don't remember who went first last time, so uh, yeah, we'll just let you spin the wheel first. Okay. Let's it's see what I like get. It's not like I can spin the wheel and choose which type I want to counter pick you. Uh... I got mined. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Okay, I will be spinning the wheel now. If I get a mine okay. type, I will be re-rolling because we shall not have the yeah. same one. I have an air type. Oh. Interesting. So we have two types that have no effect on each other. I mean, uh, yeah. I mean, at least it's something. I mean, it, it also gonna depend on coverage now. Yeah, so um, we don't have a specific advantage against each other, which is, or a weakness to each other, really. which is good. So now we're probably oh. gonna build our teams, and then we're gonna uh, explain our teams to the audience, and then we're gonna fight. So, see you yep. later! Now that the battle with Daisy is approaching, it is time to tell you all my strategy. And to say the least, um, I really don't have a um, good strategy to begin with. Let's first go over this Cosmior. It is going to be the main, the main trump card I'm gonna have. Because it's not any Cosmior, it is a secret ability Cosmior. If you don't know what it is, it is Regift. So any kind of support moves that will go on me, I can just redirect them back. This will be really good against things like possibly Gargolem, like Speed Gargolem that will most likely set up barbs, or even Gargolem Defense that can actually do things like Baffle and also barbs. And I think also Icicle Traps, which also won't be really nice. I'm gonna try to keep that ability hidden until I, it is the right time. But that is not all. I am running on this Cosmior Icicle Traps. Because uh, air types are pretty much weak to Icicle Traps, so they take much bigger damage than other Lumians. And there is one, one Lumian that I am very afraid on Daisy's team, and there is no way she is not gonna bring it. And that thing is Morfezu. This thing... This abomination of a Lumion has 150 base range attack, and that's not all. It also gets the ability Skyborne, which boosts power of its air, air type moves by 25%. Okay, it is already strong, but that's not all, because this thing in a um, monotype challenge like this is very broken, because of one of because one of its moves is called Expert Onslaught. Which normally is not too scary, it is, I think, pretty much 50 base power. But, for every air type Lumion on your team, this move's power gets boosted by 50. So while having a full team of air types, this move's power is just ridiculous. Even my, even, even my Meditoad. That has 200 HP and some range defense in invested. Still, Morfezu can deal more than half of its HP, which is very scary. But that's where this comes in. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to lead off with Cosmior instead of Icicle Traps. It depends what exactly she leads with. If it's Gargolem or Morfezu. I will most likely try to switch out, but if it's something different, I can go for Icicle Traps. And the thing is, all of air types have the move called Gust, 
Gust not only boosts speed, but also removes traps. And knowing that Daisy will most likely be really scared of icicle traps on her field, and by analyzing her more Fezu set, she will 90% of the time run Gust on that thing. So after I sub Icicle Traps, there is a very high chance she will immediately switch to Morfezu to get rid of those. And that will give me an opportunity to switch at the same time into my Meditoad. Which, there could be two different results. Either she's gonna go for that Gust and pretty much die from my uh, specialization boosted Thunderstrike thanks to Icicle Trap uh, chip, or she can either switch out and leave those Icicle Traps, which could be really bad for especially things like Gargolem, which take massive damage from it because both of its typings are weak to Ice, which, is, which makes them 4 times weak to it. So we can pretty much get half of its HP gone with one switch into Icicle Traps. But it can also pretty much backfire if Daisy goes um, with unpredictable strategies and that is being a dumbass and actually forgetting about stuff like this. Which already happened one time. Let's hope she's not gonna be such a dumbass this time and actually falls for this. If not, Morfezu pretty much kills everything on my team. Unless I can actually kill some of those air types beforehand, but I don't think she's gonna let me do that, let's be honest. She's not gonna let this expert onslaught power go down. As for the other members, you can see I have Mutagon with Heavy Shield. I noticed that many of the air types are mostly range attackers, which this melee bulk won't really be much of a help. I still kept it for things like Gargolem, of course. But I invested a lot into the range defense, I mean, my UPs are still not great. But I also give it heavy shield so I can still live better those range attacks, especially with tank. If I switch in, I have tank and now very easily at least tank one hit. This could also be helpful against Morfezu, so I can go things for like Frost Punch or even against Gargolem. So yeah. As for the Ferroglyph, this is pretty much a filler, like I didn't know what else to take, the, the, everything else wasn't that great. But I thought why not use Ferroglyph and show how good this thing can actually be sometimes. Basically I am gonna try to go for a sweep with Peace of Mind, Psychoblast, Dark Surge and Special Burst. I, it is just... It can be good, it's just hard to play with, with it really. And Another one is Be Warned. We already, if you watched some previous challenges, you already seen this guy. It's motivational, reduces the energy cost of moves by 10% of all of your allies, which could be really crucial on some situations where we are actually gonna have to stall some energy. With this little fella. Okay, listen, I know I always into these challenges, I am going with Drop of Youth Lumion because for some reason it always ends up like this. I know, listen, I know it's stupid, but hear me out, it can work. This thing with Drop of Youth is actually more tanky than its evolution. And this thing can still learn that one broken move called Stratagem, which takes its range defense stats to calculate the damage, which was um, very clever, that can be a lot of damage, especially if we have peace of mind, and we can rejuvenate. We can potentially, and I mean potentially, try and set up before Morfezu comes in, but that most likely won't happen. But we also have health gift. I decided to actually keep the health gift for one reason. If my Meditote goes f into very low HP, I can still go into this Somara and actually health gift and get all of its HP back. Just in case, because my Meditote is literally the only answer to all of her team. And now it's time for the last member, and that is Metronet. I'm going to go for Metro Burst just so I can Soul Burst. 
this thing is basically not really to sweep. It's more like to scare Daisy with it. I don't expect this thing to sweep, especially with things like Morpheus existing. But we can still deal some good damage and it's really my kind of answer to Gargolem attack especially because everything on this team is pretty much weak to dark, except this. But sadly we don't really have anything to hit it back super effectively and this thing will most likely run clutch plushy, which is a problem. Especially that my UPs are not really that great either. I don't expect this thing to do any good, I just want to scare Daisy with it, so... Our main sweeper, pretty much, will be Meditoad, especially it has Grateful Plushy. I'm gonna try to at least once set it into something to take super effective hit. It depends what she brings. I can also expect Cinnamoth. Because Cinnamoth also has a super effective hit on everything, especially Metronet. And that is Ferroblast. And Metronet is four times weak to that. So she might still bring that thing, even though she jokingly said that thing is terrible. It is terrible. But she still might bring it just for this challenge, because it is still very good against me. Okay, that was pretty much all of my team and how I'm going to play with it. I think it's time for me to actually see if it's gonna work out or not. Okay, let's see how this battle will end. And we are back with a team review. So, for the team, I made... I have used the Vintrix because it has Brain Freeze, which will be good to use against his mind types. Uh, then, I guess, just stream, because, um... Well, n no reason in particular, to be honest. Just stab and to increase my speed. Then, this is just the basic stats. Cinema, of course, um... It can one-shot Metronet. Even, I'm pretty sure it can one-shot it even... Uh, without a soul burst state where it has a lot of flutter if he sets up any traps I don't think he can just um, as much speed as possible as much range attack Marfenzo of course Metal Blast against all the again, mind and ancient types which there is one which is very tanky so um, yeah there is two actually. A Noteling and Cosmere. Expert Onslaught because we are always getting the max damage with a full team of air types. Peace of Mind, Gust. It's useless to um, give it a mind move because we are all resisted. Shrewd Blast is also not useful. And just the normal stats. It's called the Hell Family because it's pretty tanky. Monet is using the Clutch Plushy so it could set up, but actually, I, m I might change it and put it on Cinemoth. And uh, put Vow one on uh, and give Monet the, the ice. I will give it for a shell. Just in case we have something tanky on the enemy side. And Shotosaur, which I'm hoping to get uh, hit by a contact move. Then I will increase my speed while I magnify, and then I can soul burst and sweep. Pretty sure. Base of stats. Of course, it's holding the Megastone. New Typhoon with Milkshake. As much speed as possible. Base of stats. And Petrifying Ability against all his ranged attackers. And also near enchantment. 
so that if he has melee attackers, they can't do much. He doesn't have much attacking power, so he's just here to be annoying. And here are my not so great sets. I'm using uh, Odayaga, a physical Odayaga, because there are not many physical air types, if you look at it. At least uh, Odayaga can do both. Also, I might actually make it mixed. D does it? Does it learn? Uh... Spectral burst. It does. But dark surge is better. So depending on the situation. She can uh, use it. And yes, I don't have a, a mind move because, well, what's the point? Since it's resisted. Well, I have Gargolem. Which is also built into melee damage with some input into ranged attack. Ability Master, of course, if I can get some heal off, I can... Just sweep with slap down. I also have earthquake and nose dive. Nose dive is uh, for a uh, violina because uh, it is uh, not weak to dark, which is, which could be a small problem. And dark surge is just there in case he has like melee tanks. Earthquake is for media toad. So, that's basically my sets. So, let's get into call with him and let's see how the battle goes. Okay. And let the battle begin. Who did you brought? Uh, let's see. Oh. Yep, I, I knew it. No. <laughs> Who did you expect Don't me to bring? <laughs> and also, I knew it you were gonna take Sunamov. I also, I didn't get paid it. I knew it you were gonna take it. I do. I that was actually the last minute edition, <laughs> just for your information. <laughs> I I knew you, that's gonna happen. So, who are you starting with? Oh, I am. I know who you're starting uh, with. Okay, that is uh. Okay, I am I am very much aware of who you freaking uh, started with. <laughs> uh, okay, that is kinda... do, do I need do I need you? No, I actually I don't. I wait. Don't. Uh... Okay, well, okay, okay, okay. okay. Uh. Okay. Yes. Okay. Did uh. you start? Yeah, but... Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, that Very is interesting. interesting. Hmm. I'm waiting. I do not remember what. Ah, <laughs> oh, okay, <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Okay. Um. Hmm. <laughs> Magnify, okay. Hmm. I'm just going to take those little fellas on. Okay. Okay, okay. <laughs> I got ways. I got I got ways. Okay. I got I got ways. What so what dies? What do you mean dies? Oh. What do you mean, dice? <laughs> That's why I have this thing. You know I'm That's still why I have you. that. I'm still gonna live for at least one. Right? No. Oh, I, maybe I'm not. I'm plus two. 
Pyroblast or Cyroblast? I made calculations. I thought you're gonna go for Pyroblast again. No, I'm not Boots. Why would I go for Pyroblast again? It's not super effective. I click the green button. <laughs> Okay, how can I deal with that efficiently? That's the question now. Don't let me sweep you with Cinemoth! Uh, that's the problem, I've... If I, I sweep you with Cinemoth, we're doing another battle. <laughs> I thought I could live one hit because I had heavy shield on this Milagon, and, and a lot of investment in ranged bulk. I guess it wasn't enough. Ah, I see. I am plus two, stab! That Cinemoth. is a Cinemoth, I remind you. That is a Cinemoth. Let me check how much the Cinemoth have <laughs> base. Uh, because uh, okay, I can't yeah, check right now. I am in the waiting for you. 92 range attack. Okay, fair enough. I yeah, that so is... Not much. And that's... Yeah, there is and that's not Airblade. 70, 70 power. So, uh, yeah. Not much. I guess I have to do this. I don't have much other option. Okay. Okay, what are you gonna do? <laughs> Let me just tell you yeah, one fact. I made calculations. I you do not kill me. With anything. Yeah. You do That's not kill problem. me. Off. With anything. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna turn off. I thought I could live at least once I could, you know, frost punch to death, but uh, I guess that didn't work. Yeah, Frost Punch! That's the worst. Uh, I mean, I have to get. I guess I have to do it at least for the damage. Yeah. I need to get some damage. Maybe crit. Maybe crit. But do you know which move does Maybe. the most damage to me? Uh, I know which one, because I don't have anything super effective against you. That's the, that's the worst thing. Well, a shiny Metronet! You know, if... Yeah, that's, that's yeah. correct. Okay. Yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot. I calculated I for you to go for yeah. uh, peace of mind first. I'm not gonna peace of mind against that thing. With plus two. Like... Oh, he's supposed to do like 99% to me, with pe and then I was like, ah, oh, that's with peace of mind. No. <laughs> yeah, that is, yeah. And I'm off! Look at him go! That was the worst. Look at her go! Yeah, I was scared of that thing. <laughs> I was also scared of Morpheus. You have a lot of things that can actually hit me very hard. That was the worst. Morpheus does not have any super effective moves. I did calculations, and believe me, that doesn't matter. Also, yes, I did bring Expert Onslaught, because well, my full team is yes, Airtype. Yes, I know! My full team is Airtype, what, what, what else would I do? <laughs> okay, yeah. So, what, I don't what really you need to do of... is anything over base 80 speed. Wait. I have an idea. The hell he learns? I don't know how well... <laughs> I don't know how it's that gonna work. Please. No. Nope, it's not. I hope I could live. <laughs> the, the book. I had red for plushy. Of course you did. <laughs> I hoped. Yeah, that is. This Sonomoth is literally so effective on against everything I have. I mean, I'm out of energy. I mean. Leonie, please save me. I don't think you want to do that. You should have. You should have killed me. I don't think I can kill with that much. I'm gonna heal. <laughs> uh, I can do this. Oh damn! Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hmm. I could just go for a little, uh, a little this. I know I take a lot of damage, but uh... yeah, you do. Which is kind of the worst. 
Can I kill? That's a question. Um, yeah, that is a good question. Because I for sure outspeed you. You surely do. I mean, plus two Cinemorph was stronger and that did no damage. <laughs> I mean... Let's pray. Yeah, slap down. Of course I went for physical nope, move. <laughs> I hoped I could at least lift up a few. But no. Cross the I can't really do much. Yeah, and you have Master. Of course I have Master. At least I can now go to this. Hmm, Cosmir. Yes. Now should I go for... Hmm. Not worth it. What does more? Hmm. Uh, set times. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. What does what does what does more? What does more? Okay. Shade pearl. Oh, oh, that's <laughs> too much damage. I could blast. That is way too mm. much damage. Ah, yes. Hello. I hate this. <laughs> yeah, there's... I no guess you were shady, but shade this. pearl. Very shady. Yeah. Oh, no yeah, way. that's no way. That's some of screw me off completely. GG's! <laughs> Wanna do another one? No, no, that's... Okay. okay, well, thank you everyone for watching. Uh, <laughs> thank you, Amingo, for joining me. I uh, hope to see you next time when we battle. And good luck. <laughs> you need it. Yes. Bye-bye. Say bye. Bye.